What's up, Internet? This is Rambling Josh, and you're watching another episode of a Let's Play Electronic Super Joy. Today we have frogs, apparently. I guess that's what the little thingies are. So... So far, so good. That was not especially hard. Don't even have to jump! Uh, Except for this part. Whoa! Uh, I dodged the first spiky thing with much skill, but the second one is proving to be my superior. Whoa! Stay away from me, bro. Uh, I don't want none of those spikes. I guess someone decided that it's best if we jump. Why did I stomp? There's no need to do that. Except apparently there is a need? Okay, I need to jump off the right side of this thing. There we go. Ah! Yeah, you thought you could trick me by sliding over real quick. But I'm onto your tricks, bro. Overshot a little bit. Gotta try and stay on the right side here a little bit, too. Otherwise, I don't think you make enough distance. Oh, let's delay a second. Maybe that'll improve the pattern a little bit. Ah, oh, so close. Nah, that wasn't going to work anyways. Huh. Well, that works. That level was actually not that hard. And apparently you're not supposed to fall down there, because you will be unable to return. The Groove Wizard? That's the guy who stole our posterior. Oh. Checkpoint! Stay away from the little lightsaber at the end of the screen. And fail the jump. Checkpoint. That's an odd set of two checkpoints right after one another. Can I even make that? I mean, I think you, you're supposed to be able to. I guess not. Okay, I'm not even gonna try and go fast here. Slippery goo. Ah! Yeah. Oh, that, yeah. That one star there is, I would say, either the hardest or the second hardest in the game to get, oh, so. Yeah. I'm not even gonna try it right now. And here we make it to the end. Another not too bad level, but I guess the existence of the star makes up for it. So we got a couple levels here in, in a row now, they're all about like sliding and stuff, and 
I really like these levels. Yes. They're all snowy and stuff, which is a cool effect, and the whole sliding business is pretty fun, I think. Because you get all this momentum, and it's... When you really nail it, it feels really good. Ah! So close. Slip sliding away. Okay, come on. Get up there. There you go. Good job. Now time for... I guess this is part three? Oh, yeah. Try not to immediately fall off the pillar. Oh, yeah. Another one that wasn't too bad. Oh, and here we can fly. Really? So basically, we have infinite jumps, more or less. We can't do that normally, like, we can't do that right now, but... The secret will be revealed soon enough. This is a pretty neat level. It can be pretty frustrating, but it's also pretty neat. So... Jumped a little too early. Yeah, those jumps. Even if I lost all my momentum, that's still fun. Oh, yeah. oh. There's uh, two or three really hard jumps in that sequence. That, that little bit at the end of this platform, jumping over that is one of the hard jumps. Making that jump can be hard too, because it's a pretty long distance. Ah, just barely overshot it. Oop, not far enough. Oop, not far enough. Too far. Too far. It's not even quite, it's a very tight balance between like when you jump and how long you hold the button. And we die. So there's a little pair of wings there that you have to pick up and that enables you to fly. Really? I missed the wings? I could have sworn I went right by them, but I guess whatever. Okay, I think there's only the three gates there. Yes. And I got the star too. I think that's the last snow level. We're really flying through World 3 now. I think it might just... I know a, a few other people who really dislike those oh levels and had a lot of trouble with them, but I like them, so... That's why I think... I... don't have much trouble with them? Maybe it's the other way around. This bit's kind of tricky, I think. Yeah, I don't think I... I think there's a star here that I can't get now because I don't have momentum in my... flying. I'm just gonna start the level over, honestly. Because not having the, that momentum makes the whole rest of the level, like, really hard. Okay, 
Okay, still got my momentum. Perfect. Don't need those wings. And I missed those wings, so I'm probably going to run out of flying and die. Or not. Okay. So this level's kind of weird. Um, the whole point of this level is that there's, I think, like five different stars or four different stars or something here. But the level itself is really easy. So for now, I think I'm just going to leave the stars be. It's okay to chicken out. Have fun fighting the Groove Wizard! Just die a few times there for fun because that's apparently my idea of fun. Okay, so the idea here is to not get stomped by the missile. Okay, stomp the heart. That's not what I wanted to do. Basically, you have to heart stomp this heart, I think, three times. Yeah, so that's not too hard. You wanna dance? Let's dance. Goodbye. And I just killed myself. Now I have to do it over again? I guess not. Normally the game is not quite this nice about it. Well, he came out of nowhere. So, he likes to shoot lots of missiles at you, and I fell a little bit too far there. here is obviously to dodge the missiles by weaving up and down. If I get a little bit further left here. Oh, they're still behind me. So one more salvo missiles? Or zero more? One more, apparently. I think it's one more anyways, it could well be more. Whoa! Get away from me! It's a trap! And now... This is what we... What the real fight is all about. Wonderful. Ah! Maybe not be so close to him. I always forget that he throws out the little shuriken things at the start. Because usually this fight is all about the missiles. Ideally I want the missiles to be as tight as possible, because the tighter they are, the easier it is to dodge all of them. Stop the shurikens anytime. There you go. So many missiles. Ah! There's like one stray missile there. The idea is to just go in kind of like circular motions to try and dodge them all, but when you've got like four different sets of. I guess I went a little too high. When you've got like four different sets of missiles, it can get, get, bleh, get kind of hard. That's not the ideal way to deal with that. That's not the ideal way to do anything except for dying. I knew I was gonna hit that. Missile is a little close for comfort. Come on, okay. 
I thought it was gonna hit me. Ah, they're like complete opposite to each other. But those ones synced up a little bit. Ah, oh, I almost got through the gap there. Missed uh, an input, I just didn't hit the button. Oh, almost fell to my death there because I was itching my nose. Ah, almost did it again. Because, like, this part of the start is not super hard. Even dealing with the, little, the big salvos of missiles is not especially hard. But making your way through both of them can be hard. my grip on the controller a little bit here so I can mash jump faster and go up faster when I need to. just sloppiness. These missiles are not especially tight. The looser the missiles are grouped, the more area they take up on the screen. The more likely it is that you're going to run into one by accident. Shurikens. <gasps> Oof, that was close. Oh, come on. Okay, good. Yeah, keep going. Those are grouped up pretty decently. Oh, up, up, up. Okay, come on. Got a pretty good pattern going here. Up. And we're done. first time I did that, I fell to my death and didn't get the warp. Kind of like that. He stole everyone's butt. Shake all the booty. The groove has control. Yeah, whatever. And that's the end of that. This portal goes into the credits. Pope Boris the Super Sexy. And yeah, that's the end of that. Huh, you actually control how fast the credits go, apparently. 
So that's being electronic super joy. It speaks for itself, really. It's a pretty fun little game. So maybe give it a try. Uh, how many stars do we got here? I think we're missing five or six. Missing one in world two. Four. Yeah, so we're missing five stars. So I think we'll do so a little bit more uh, in the coming up to try and unlock the bonus worlds, but truth be told, I don't think I can actually beat any of the bonus worlds, so I guess we'll see how that goes. If that ends up happening, then I guess I'll see you on the next episode of Ele Let's Play Electronic Super Joy. If not, then I won't. See you later.